Brought to you by GTA, your island, your network. He's fallen victim to burglary many times, but when Jugo resident Tony Ariola called 911 for help, he says he was left waiting for hours for police to respond. Sometimes, you know, the half day, sometimes the, you know, the next day. Ariola and his wife had the chance to voice these concerns to the Guam Police Department today at the Jigo McDonald's. It's called the Coffee with a Cop Initiative. Coffee free of charge, conversation with members of the force who for months have made rounds at each of the fast food chain's locations to get input from residents. So at least you know, I can present my problem with them. And uh, I hope, you know, they can really change. Ariola's concerns could be addressed soon thanks to newly introduced legislation that gives GPD property in Jigo, which they may use to build a police precinct. Chief of Police J.I. Cruz acknowledges they need to accommodate the village's growing population. Currently, Jigo is being serviced by the Dededo Precinct Command. With that uh, idea in mind, we're looking at an even quicker response time for calls for service up here in the Jigo area. Aside from slow response times, Chief Cruz says here are concerns about curfew. Cruz reminds residents that curfew law states minors cannot be out from 10 p.m. to 6 a.m. from Sunday through Thursday without an adult. On Fridays and Saturdays, curfew law allows minors to be out until midnight. This, he says, is a seasonal issue because students are out for summer break. Should any of our residents see that, definitely contact the Guam Police Department, report it to us. Most especially if you suspect that they're involved in some type of criminal activity, whether it be graffiti is, is a, a lot of times what we see underage drinking, uh, you know, drinking under the age of 21. You see, we, we often see that. Uh, please report that to the Guam Police Department because those have a tendency to lead to other crimes which are usually more serious than just those statutory crimes. Another concern for northern residents is drug usage. Chief Cruz credits the public for reporting crimes and giving tips that have led to drug raids and arrests. We're getting a lot of good tips. We're getting a lot of good information about what's happening in the community. Brought to you by GTA, your island, your network.